caught selling drugs at school. Tonight, two twin brothers are heading to prison instead of their Westlake classroom. News Channel 5's Curtis Jackson joins us live tonight with their story. Danita, they were young men with bright futures until the lure of drugs and money put it all in jeopardy. You may not know them, but twin brothers Mitchell and Martin Heidelman are the boys next door. The boys you usually see making jump shots in the driveway, not standing in orange jumpsuits. The boys you usually see headed off to college, not prison. It's something that happens in every floor of this justice center every single day. Uh, drugs have entered their lives. Uh, it's taken them down. But the 18-year-olds from Westlake weren't just drug users. Years of addiction took them from being patrons to being pushers. Welcome to Marilyn Heidelman's Nightmare. It's been a nightmare for two, two, more than two years. Now other Westlake parents are having the same bad dream. From pills to heroin, the twins found their clientele from among their classmates. Their criminal acts of transporting, selling, and distributing drugs on school property has long-lasting negative effects on the student body. The twins expressed remorse before receiving identical sentences of 14 months. I was acting out of uh, selfishness and uh, immaturity, and uh, I come to realize that you know, I was wrong. I'm deeply sorry for everything I've done. Words their mother admits she's heard before. She just never thought she'd hear them here. We were there for our kids. So how does this happen to someone like me? I don't know. But the simple fact is drugs are on every corner in America and perhaps now more easily purchased from the boys next door. I spoke with the Heidelmans by phone tonight. They did not want to comment again on camera. They simply want other parents to be aware that this can happen. Live in the newsroom, Curtis Jackson, News Channel 5.